I'm thrilled that the time has come for you and the world to see the B-21 Raider. It was a truly historic day that would be remembered for years to come. After much anticipation, the B-21 Raider has been unveiled. It was the release of the most advanced aircraft of its kind that has ended a decade of secrecy. In this video, we will show you the world's first sixth generation aircraft. With its sleek design and cutting edge technology, the B-21 Raider is now ready to take flight and redefine the world of aviation. It's finally here. Meet the B-21 Raider, the world's first sixth generation aircraft. The world has never seen technology like that produced by Northrop Grumman for the B-21. As part of ground testing, the B-21 aircraft's first loads calibration test was performed in May 2022, and with final wrap-ups made over the past few months, the live debut of the B-21 Raider took place in Palmdale, California on December 2, 2022. Designed to deliver both conventional and nuclear weapons, the B-21 Raider is a dual-capable penetrating strike stealth bomber. Combined with the B-21s and B-52s, it will form the backbone of the future Air Force bomber force. America's enduring air power capability is ensured by the B-21, which is designed to operate in today's high-end threat environment. In addition to intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance, the B-21 Raider also features electronic attack, communication, and other capabilities. It is designed to accommodate manned or unmanned operations and is nuclear capable. Moreover, it can use both standoff and direct attack munitions. If you're enjoying this video so far, be sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel for more videos. In recognition of their courageous surprise attack against Japan during World War II on April 18, 1942, the B-21 Raider was aptly named after the Doolittle Raiders of the U.S. Army Air Force. This bold mission forced the Japanese to recall their combat forces for home defense and significantly raised the morale of Americans and U.S. allies alike. As the first bomber of the 21st century, the B-21 Raider is a fitting tribute to the historic Doolittle Raiders. Pratt & Whitney, a Raytheon Technologies subsidiary, BAE Systems, GKN Aerospace, Janicki Industries, Orbital ATK, Rockwell Collins, part of Collins Aerospace, and Spirit Aerosystems are among the major subcontractors participating in the B-21 program. Northrop Grumman is constantly improving stealth technology, adopting new manufacturing processes and materials to assure the B-21 will evade anti-access area denial weapons. This outstanding company was chosen over the Boeing-Lockheed Martin collaboration for the USAF's next long-range strike bomber. In October 2015, Northrop Grumman was awarded the contract for the engineering and production development phase. As a result of the award of the contract in 2015, Northrop Grumman has assembled a nationwide team that is developed developing, testing, and building the world's most advanced strike aircraft. More than 8,000 employees from Northrop Grumman, industry partners, and the Air Force are involved in the B-21 project. More than 400 vendors from 40 states make up the team. The Penetrating Strike Stealth Bomber is set to be the lead command for the Air Force Global Strike Command and will have a minimum inventory of 100 aircraft with an average procurement unit cost of $692 million. In 2021, Ellsworth Air Force Base in South Dakota underwent a detailed environmental impact statement process as demanded by the National Environment Policy Act and other relevant regulations to identify the base as the primary operating base for the B-21 bomber and to designate it as the location of the formal training unit. The B-21 had been designed with an open systems architecture to reduce integration risk and enable competition for future modernization efforts to allow for the aircraft to evolve as the threat environment changes. The B-21 bomber is a digital bomber constructed in a digital world. Northrop Grumman employs agile software development, sophisticated manufacturing processes, and digital engineering tools to decrease production risk on the B-21 program and allow contemporary sustainment procedures. This includes digital capabilities into the aircraft's development, construction, and testing, as well as the method by which it will be delivered to the United States Air Force. The B-21 program is utilizing Kubernetes, an open-source framework for automating the deployment, scaling, and administration of containerized applications. In 2022, the USAF's B-21 team used containerized software using Kubernetes on flight-ready hardware. The B-21 is outfitted with next-generation radar-absorbent materials, giving it its stealthy characteristics. Its high computing capacity enables it to analyze information from onboard sensors and other sources fast in order to detect threats. It features minimal aircraft signatures in many frequency bands to reduce the likelihood of interception. The improved capabilities enable the B-21 bombers to breach existing and future defenses. 
Long range and large payloads strongly indicate that the B-21 is subsonic. The bomber is expected to provide flexibility to launch both conventional and nuclear munitions, penetrating and surviving capabilities in advanced air defense environments, support for manned and unmanned operations, and is armed with conventional weapons, the long range standoff missile, and B-6112 gravity bombs. The B-21 Raider will play an important role in a wider family of conventional long range strike weapons and complementing systems, which will include electronic attack, intelligence surveillance and reconnaissance, communication, and other capabilities. It will be able to operate in anti-access area denial scenarios in the future. Along with addressing today's threats, the B-21 Raider will be able to adapt quickly to future threats. This reshapes everything for the future of warfare and promises to enhance America's air superiority, revolutionizing the way war is fought. With its advanced avionics, powerful weapons systems, and innovative design, the B-21 Raider is sure to be an impressive addition to the Air Force's arsenal. Tell me, did you watch the live unveiling of the B-21 Raider stealth bomber? Let us know if you did and what you thought about it in the comments. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to Military Minds for more news about this incredible aircraft. I'll see you next time.